What's up guys, what's going on? Camp Out coming at you with a review. Uh, as you can see, the box is from Japan, size 28.5, that is US 11. The fit is a little snug for me. I probably could have did 11 and a half. And as you can see, they are beams times Mita times Asics Gel Light 3. So the uh, design of the shoe is based off of the souvenir jacket with all these little design hits here, as you can see. Um, very, very clean. I like the aesthetic of the shoe. I like the quilt. I didn't know how I'd feel about it once I got it in hand, but I do like it a lot. Uh, basic colors, you got black, and then you got this camo green as the outsole and the footbed, and then you got a hit of uh, white and gold on the heel counters and the patches. These are patches. It's not like plastic or anything like that. These are stitched into the shoe, which is a nice clean little effect. Sharp on the detailing, they did a very good job as far as glue stains, there's no stains on the shoe, no stitches hanging out, everything is very, very clean, quality control is on point, let's get into the detail. This is the right shoe, so lateral side, you got this little very, very smooth brush suede across the toe capping, and the rest of the paneling on the uh, lateral side as far as the tiger striping, the grommet area rolling into the heel counter, you got a hit that's stitched in Japan, which is where both of the shops are located if you were unfamiliar in Japan. You got a quilt as a toe box and you can see that quilt throughout the rest of the shoe in all of the underlay areas. Let me get this light a little higher for you so you can see what I'm talking about. You got your window here is um, basically all quilt. There's no 3M hit like you'd normally see. Underlay on the, uh, the uh, tiger striping is all quilt again. The inside sock liner is quilt. Everywhere that's not suede is quilt, which is very, very clean. It's very simple, but to the point, I like it a lot. As I showed you already in the heel counter, you got your suede, you got suede in the window or where the window should be, ASICs in the uh, embroidery, and then you got your patch embroidery logo. Also, you got a hit of the quilt on the upper portion of the heel counter, rolling into the medial side, mirrored from the lateral side. You have all that suede again, and something going on out my window, but sorry about that if you can hear it. Quilt, as mirrored from the lateral side, like I said, a couple of pieces of cardboard from the box, but it's basically mirrored from the outs, uh, from the lateral side. You got a hit of Mita on the split tongue on the right side for the right shoe, and asymmetrical, you got beams on the left shoe on the split tongue, as you can see here, very, very clean. Midsole is black, outsole has got this army camouflage green, very nice effect, reminds me of the Altitude 13 if you caught the breakdown, so you already knew I was probably gonna cop these. But other than that, I hope you guys liked the review. Uh, Thus far, the footbed, you got the chain link fence that's synonymous with Mita. If you see any of their posts, all their shoes are always up against this. I don't know what the uh, the rest of the story behind the fence is because I'm not from there, so whatever. And I couldn't find anything in the blogs about it, so I just went with it. Uh, I don't know what this symbol means either. I'm sure it has some kind of substantial meaning. So if you guys know, shoot me in the comment section. I know you guys from all over the place, which is pretty cool. And I'm going to throw this back in here. Asymmetrical again, you got beams on this one before I forget, and then you have Mita sneakers on the uh, the other footbed, which I'll pull out because the light is too bright. So, so you can see what that looks like. Your extras are as follows, flat laces in them, and then you got like these rope wax laces that came as extras. I don't know if I'm gonna try these out and see what they look like, but they seem, they seem kinda cool. Uh, you can see beams on the lace tips of this one, and then Mita MS on the other lace tips, or the agolets. All right, guys, hope you liked the review. If you uh, aren't subscribed yet, please do so. If you liked the video, shoot me a thumbs up. If you got something you want to talk about, hit me in the comment section. And as always, peace.